Hi everyone. So I want to bring you some Ethereum misconceptions. I want to debunk some misconceptions related to Ethereum. And first today, the misconception that I bring you is running a node requires 32 ETH. And the reality is that no, you can run a node with zero. And in fact, even until before the merge with proof of work, you can run a full node and not being a miner. And just the same way, with proof of stake, you can run a node and not being a staker. So the difference is that if you run a node and you are not staking 32 bits, then you are a non-validator node. So you are not really, you are not proposing blocks of transactions, but your node is doing a useful job. It's uh, verifying the uh, transactions and blocks that the other validators propose. So you can imagine you have this huge network of validators, right? Some of them are validator nodes and they propose blocks of transactions. If they misbehave, they are slashed, they lose part of their reward. And as soon as they broadcast the their new blocks, the other nodes, including the non-validator nodes, will verify those blocks. So you are doing a useful job. Why would you want to deploy a non-validator node? Well, you can deploy it first for fun. I think it's a lot of fun. Uh, second, you may have a DAP. You may be a developer and you want your DAP to talk directly uh, to, to, to talk with the blockchain directly through your nodes. Uh, or you may want just to contribute to the ecosystem and contribute to, for more decentralization. Um, what else? Well, what if you have less than 32 weeks and you want to run a node? Well, there, is, there are some uh, uh, some uh, node as a service, how do they call it? Staking as a service. You can go to the Ethereum website and check this alternative. So you have these services that are provided by third parties and they, they basically run the node on your behalf. It's like a cloud provider and some of them require only 16 ETH. And then the third option would be uh, staking pools. You have staking pools like Lido, Rocket Pool, where you can deposit any amount. It can be 0 0.1, 0 0.5, 1 ETH, whatever. Um, but you are not really, a no really running any, any nodes. Um, you are just giving the money and, and they deploy uh, their nodes and all that stuff. All right, I hope this was useful. Let me know if you want to deploy a node. To deploy a node, post merge, you need to deploy, you need to have two clients. You need to have a consensus client like Prism, and you need to have an execution client like Get. And these will talk between each other um, using an engine API. And you need the initial deployment is a little bit more like not hard but it takes time because your nodes need to synchronize but it's all good it's actually a lot of fun if you are very geeky of course all right i'll see you on the next one where i'll talk i will talk about more uh, debunking more misconceptions bye